Hey YouTube, uh, this is a, another one of those collectibles update videos. Here we have uh, 1960s, late 1960s, 1970s uh, soda cans. Here we have one by a company called Gala. It's a draft root beer can. Um, I decided to start collecting these because, as you all know, I am a big collector of lunch boxes and I am really into the lithographs and the artwork and the colors uh, you know the artistic integrity of the lunch boxes so I thought wow you know I saw these and they have lithographs on them now that's the first one Gala Draft Root Beer we're gonna go on to the next one this is another one this is a grape soda can uh, from Sunset Valley or is it no Sweet Valley rather um, uh, it's got the pull tab uh, there's the bottom of the can um, these are really neat though and uh, like I said the lithograph you know is similar to that of the lunchbox or the paint that's on it I'm not sure if it's paint or if it's a lithograph maybe somebody can help me with that what was really cool about these is uh, this is actually a bicentennial commemorative um, 1776 to 1976 uh, graphs cola what was really cool about these is they would put historical facts uh, great American inventors on the back of the can so you get all these really great facts about like American history um, and that type of thing and uh, I'm not even really sure if I don't think these companies are still in business uh, this one's from a company called graphs cola um, next one, yeah, is another Graps. This is a Graps root beer, sugar-free root beer. I'm um, taking that that most of these are probably from the mid, like early to mid '70s. Um, but uh, they're really cool. It kind of gives you a glimpse into the past of uh, of the uh, you know the soda can, um, the way they the way they used to look, and you know, kind of like I mean, everybody knows what they look like now, but it gives you an idea of what. They had looked like before. Right, on to the next one. Next one we have here is a Mark Company orange soda can. Um, and uh, that one's got a little bit of rust, but still pretty cool nonetheless. Um, I'm thinking that might be like late 60s, maybe. Um, all right, on to the next one another graphs also a bicentennial 1976 orange soda artificially flavored of course and on the back this one also has this one says stars and stripes um, the 34 year or 34 star flag of the Union rather um, flying proudly from the little ironclad monitor on March 8th 1862 when she successfully challenged the Confederate iron-clad Merrimax and was witness to a historic moment, beginning of the end of the wooden warships. So, all right, on to the next one. We have a Canfield's sugar-free draft root beer. The great thing about these is I think it kind of gives you a glimpse into the into this past too, like with the seventies you know kind of gives you that idea of what the 70s were like in a way um, through the soda you know you get get an idea you know of the early art, earlier artwork for soda cans um, and I, I just I just like collecting different things and I started to I just figured these would be great and eventually I hope to display them somehow it's from a company called Vess all right, next one. This is really cool. This is a All-Star Game, July 15th, 1975, County Stadium, Graphs Cola. Um, Milwaukee Brewers, uh, National League versus American League. And uh, it's just really cool. It's got just, just screams American, Americana. Really? Um, Alright, on to the next one. 
Uh, this one, this one is actually um, is a '60s can. This is from Ideal Company, black cherry soda uh, with other natural flavors. This is what they call a flat flat top can, um, where it doesn't have the pull tab. As you can see, they open the bottom to get the soda or the liquid out. Um, but yeah, this is really cool. Uh, there's the liner for the company, but it's ideal can, black cherry soda. All right, on to the next one. This is really cool. It's uh, this almost has. It kind of reminds me of like the old candy shop look. Um, they, I know they used to have this. Uh, the the uh, actually some of the old candy, um, the bags of candy that you would get in the '70s, would have this kind of design on it, um, like in the early '70s. Crafts draft style root beer. So that's pretty neat. I like the design of that one. All right, on to here we go. This is uh, cola, big K. Um, not really too sure. Somebody was telling me they thought it was Kmart, but I don't. I don't think so. I'm not really sure if I, I don't think they had Big K in the '70s. But uh, anyway, there's that one. And to the bottom. Here's another graphs. It's sugar-free diet cherry soda. Pretty neat. All right. On to. Here we go. Here's a Lipton iced tea. This is the one everybody's going to know. This one, of course, you know, who doesn't know Lipton iced tea? Uh, it's lemon flavored. Uh, this one's actually a bank, or it was turned into a bank. And uh, I mean, that, that's it. That's my soda can collection. I'm started to get into soda cans, collecting those. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.